Good afternoon, Mr. Montgomery. This is Wanda Richards. I'd love to help you, Dr. Richards. My lender asked me to contact you in order to get an inspection of my home for the purpose of an appraisal. Fortunately for you, I do have an appointment open tomorrow at 12 noon, if that works for you. Yeah, I was looking for Dr. Richards. Is he here? You don't recognize my voice? It's a window. We spoke on the phone yesterday. Uh... Hello? Hello, is this Mr. Lewis Montgomery? This is him speaking. May I ask who's calling? Good afternoon, Mr. Montgomery. This is Wanda Richards. My lender asked me to contact you in order to get an inspection of my home for the purpose of an appraisal. When do you think you might be able to come by? Oh, Dr. Richards, yes. Your lender had reached out to me and told me to expect a call from you. I'd love to help you, Dr. Richards. Fortunately for you, I do have an appointment open tomorrow at 12 noon, if that works for you. Oh, tomorrow it works great. Um, and please, call me Wendell. Excellent, Wendell. Uh, please text me the address so I know where I'm going for tomorrow. Okay, I will. Um, see you tomorrow, Mr. Montgomery. Oh, please, call me Lewis. <laughs> okay, Lewis. Bye-bye. You don't see a historic property in this kind of shape. Nice neighborhood too. Let's see. Hi, um, is Dr. Richards here? Lewis? Yeah, I was looking for Dr. Richards, is he here? You don't recognize my voice? It's a window. We spoke on the phone yesterday. Uh, oh, yeah, I've, I'm a bit off this morning, I'm sorry. <laughs> Busy day, huh? Yeah. Uh, just... um, come on in, please, come on in. <laughs> Welcome to my humble abode. Yeah, it's uh, very homey. Please, take your time. Um, feel free to look around. I can point you out to any I'll new I'll take it from here, Mr. Richards, thank you. Wendell, please. Well, I've seen enough here. Uh, you should expect a report from me in a few days. Any first guess on what to expect? I mean, appraisal is not a guessing game, Mr. Richards. I know very well what you probably will be expecting, but you'll have to wait for my report. Oh. So, have a nice day. I didn't mean to offend, but I look forward to hearing from you. Yeah. Let me walk you out, okay? Okay. Right, it's here. Show me the money, baby. What? He didn't put in the... What? Whoa. Hello? Hello, Lewis? May I ask who's calling? This is Wendell. You appraised my house a couple days ago? Ah, uh, yes, Mr. Richards. I already sent you your report. I know, and I'm looking at it right now. I think you made a mistake. You appraised my house for 20000 more than the original purchase price. I've been living here for 10 years, and I've put in three times that amount in renovations alone. 
I understand your concerns, Mr. Richards, but that's the fair value of your property. Everything's based on my algorithms. What, that, what do you mean? That's impossible. Well, I won't get into details as to not confuse you, but rest assured, I did salvage what I can with what you gave me to work with. But so many factors go into appraisals. You have to understand, for example, the walkability score in your area. It's very poor. Walkability? Are you, are you kidding me? I'm sorry, Mr. Richards. I, I have a client on the other line. I, 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 I have to take this call. Mr. Lewis Montgomery. I, I'm sorry you're not happy with your report, but best of luck to you. M Mr. War... I don't believe this. There's no way. Scott? Hey, buddy, how are you doing? Hey, listen, I need you to do me a huge favor. <laughs> How you doing? Ah. ah, thank you for coming by. I owe you. Oh, no problem, bro. Hey, this is some wild scheme you conjured up. I think it's really going to work. I can't believe this has to come down to this. Hey, I got a head start on the pictures. I brought all my whitey white man family photos like you asked for. Where do you want them? Start with putting some right here and um, over there, you know. Okay. Let's get started. Appraiser should be here any minute now. Just do it like we talked about. Remember, you bought this house and you want to flip it. So you need an appraisal because you think you got your steal and you want a markup. Hey, don't worry about a thing. I got this. You can count on me. Okay, all right. Hey, buddy. Can't wait. <laughs> Hey, Scott? Or should I call you doctor? Lewis, right? Yeah. Plain Scott is fine. Come in. Okay. Nice place you got here. Oh, thanks. Beautiful family. You're a lucky man. Thanks. You know, we don't live here all the time, but it uh, helps to keep the stage set. Yeah. Uh, is there anything I can get you to eat or drink, or you need help looking around? Actually, no, I just finished breakfast, but I'll take the offer for a tour if you lead the way. Let's go. So, what do you think of the place? I think it's great. I think you really know how to pick your investments. You know, the previous owner felt really bad about letting it go for so little, but he seemed kind of desperate. But either way, I couldn't pass it up. Yeah. So what do you think it's worth? Well, I'm going to have to go over my numbers, but I'm sure you'll be very satisfactory with the report. And I can tell you now, you'll probably be up a couple hundred grand, give or take. Wow. That's incredible. Thank you. Oh, absolutely. Well, I better be on my way, so you'll be hearing from me soon. Thank you, Scott.
Uh, excuse me, what the hell are you doing in my house? <laughs> Very funny. Come on in, you jerk. <laughs> so, you got the appraisal, huh? A little bit more in line with what you were looking for? Scott, he valued the house at $750,000. That's a 300000 valuation increase. I thought I was being robbed in the beginning, but man. You know, I don't know whether to feel good or bad about this crazy joke we played. <laughs> man, thank you. That was really incredible what you did for me. I owe you big time. Uh, no problem. Us white guys, we're not so bad, right? <laughs> You're not. So what now? He's on his way? He should be by here in any minute. Hey, hi, Lewis. How hey. you doing? Hey, Scott. Is everything okay? I'm not really sure why you had me coming back out here. Did I overlook something? Well, yeah. Just one little minor detail. You mind if I come in, take a look at anything? Uh, um... Yeah, but I'm not really, not really sure. But, you know, I'm not really sure if I can let you in or not. L let me call the owner. Hey, Wendell! Hello, Mr. Montgomery. Uh, hey, uh, Dr. Wendell, Mr. Dr. Richards, to uh, you. I'm a bit confused. I don't get what's going on here. Did, did you not sell your house to Mr. Kent? No, see, after your little screw up, I had to call my colleague Scott here for some help. He played his part so perfectly. I mean, I want to say I'm so ecstatic for the valuation you gave us. I can explain. This is, there's some kind of misunderstanding here. No, 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 no. There's no need. You rest assured, the local media knows everything that they need to know about your actions. And they might be reaching out to you. That, none of that's necessary. You don't need to do that. That's I'm not... a busy man, Mr. Montgomery. And thank you so much for coming over. Get out of my house. Bye. Look at him shuffling to the car with his tail between his legs. <laughs> Did you see the look on his face? <laughs> that sure felt good. <laughs> the only thing that'll feel better if the whole community finds out about it. Oh, in time they will. They'll find out in time. Don't worry about that. Hey, so what now? You hungry? Oh, you mean like a victory meal? I do owe you. <laughs> I do owe you a big favor. Yeah. Treats on me. With that evaluation you got? You're damn right the treat's on you. <laughs> I got you, buddy. 